Now, Christine is back to bring us up to date with everything that's buzzing today. Thanks very much, Claire. Well, it may be a case of abandoned ship for the astronauts on board the International Space Station. Russia today grounded all of its Soyuz rockets after one was destroyed during liftoff last week. If the rockets remain grounded beyond mid-November, there'll be no way to launch new crews before the current residents are supposed to leave. NASA says that flight controllers could keep a deserted space station operating indefinitely. Now, could iPads be set to replace books in the classroom? Some schools in Ireland are already embracing the new technology and it's going down a real treat. Oh, yes! I'm going to be pictures. This could be the classroom of the future. These first-year students at St Kevin's College in Crumlin in Dublin are pretty nifty with their iPads. They've been given them instead of books. I go like instead of books, like your back, your back haunting you when you're walking home. You can just take that. When you're on your break, you can do what you want with them. And after a while, you can bring them home. You can have all your books in one, so you can't leave one at home and say to your teacher, I've forgotten books. At the end of the five years, the students get to keep the iPads too. Not bad going. They're going to have all their school texts and a lot of their project work done online on their iPad. They'll bring it home, they'll work on it. It means their school bags will be light, the books are far more affordable, they're 40% cheaper, and the parents will pay 150 euros, and that covers all costs for going to the school for the year. Most students in Ireland are sticking with traditional methods for now. Expensive and heavy though, books could be on the way out if schools like this one give iPads the thumbs up. Okay then, now a teenage hacker who developed an iPhone tool for users to download apps that haven't been approved by Apple claims that he's been hired by Apple. Nicholas Allegra, known by his online name Comex, launched Deal Break Me 2 last year. Now the 19-year-old says he's got a job as an intern at the firm. Writing on his Twitter page, he wrote, It's been really, really fun, but it's also been a while and I've been getting bored. So the week after next, I'll be starting an internship with Apple. Apple, though, haven't commented on the claims. And finally, here's something that you don't see every day. A giant metal bird skeleton was just one of the exhibits at this year's Maker Faire in California. The event's become known as the world's largest DIY festival and is held every year. Fledgling is an avian kinetic sculpture. You can climb inside, sit in its head, and if you want to, pedal furiously to slowly move the bird's wings. Interesting, and that's you up to date with everything that's buzzing today. Back over to you, Claire. Thanks for that, Chris.